one of the northern sections on the Little River Blueway is actually at the confluence of Long King Creek and the Little River, which makes up a one of the most interesting sections of the Little River Blueway on Lake Thurman. The Blueway project started up roughly two years ago and is a partnership between the, Cor the Ar U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, the South Carolina State Park System, the, uh, the United States uh, Forestry Service, McCormick County Chamber, uh, McCormick County, and the Department of Natural Resources. And it's geared towards creating greater awareness of the amazing public assets that we have here in this area. The Blue Way is composed of roughly 63,000 acres of public lands. That's in state parks, forestry service, and, uh, and core lands. Um, 50 miles of paddling trails. It also provides roughly 150 miles of epic mountain biking trails throughout the region and all within the beauty and the scenery of this area. This area is blessed to have numerous parks and, and those are of course Corps of Engineer parks and state parks uh, both Georgia and on the South Carolina side and uh, roughly 13 parks are in this particular system so a big part of this too is about uh, encouraging families to get their kids out uh, to participate in the outdoors uh, in regards to the healthy aspects of outdoor recreation and just unplugging and getting away from the TV and, and the devices and enjoying the nature that this area provides both in the protected lands, protected waterways and the wildlife that is in this uh, amazing region. One of the first phases of developing the Little River Blue Way Adventure Area Project was mapping out the area to share with people the easy ways to use these recreational assets that we have across the region and naming sections and uh, creating the, uh, the maps and identifying all the put-ins. Just this morning, we launched from the Long Cane Creek boat ramp uh, right at the confluence of Long Cane and the Little River and we paddled up the Bordeaux section, which in its entirety is three miles. Now we paddled up about two miles and then paddled back down to the Long Cane boat ramp, which is here. But you can see this is a small section of the overall 50 miles of, of paddling trails that this area has to offer, particularly the Long Cane and Little River sections that are very, very unique sections in regards to the protected lands uh, and, and just the beauty of the area up in these northern areas. Um, the Blue Way is also more than just paddling trails. We have some excellent biking trails that you'll find throughout the, uh, throughout the maps. Um, also golf courses both at Hickory Knob State Park and Savannah Lakes Village, uh, which is a community that's located right here in the heart of the Blue Way project. Um, and then you also have vast amounts of national forest land that runs all throughout and numerous historical sites. So whether you're in it for the history, learning about the culture of the area, or into more of the adventure sports of mountain biking and stand-up paddling and, and kayaking, the Blue Way has, has something to offer for the most um, advanced ad adventure seekers to the family who's just looking to get their kids out in nature for the day.